Hi everyone, this is Killshot from 999 Gaming. I want to do a video for Empires and Allies, and this video is called Crazy Bases Number 4. So, uh, you guys seen some of the other videos, new alliance features, we got some troop sharing going on. Pretty awesome time to uh, play Empires and Allies, and you know there's going to be some wars coming right around the corner, so get your alliances ready to go. So, we're going to start uh, first Crazy Base. I'm going to do two on this one so you guys can take a look. Both of them are a waste of walls, I think. Um, this is uh, Nalds and clearly he is a bad boy so uh... not only did he uh... put the spelling out there and show us how to spell bad boy but um... he left almost every well I, not almost he left every defensive structure he has completely unprotected so you might as well just say here's uh... change your, your name to free loot because that's exactly what it's going to be i'm going to storm through this base and uh... take everything so if you really want to be a bad boy Put your walls to good use and defend. But um, you definitely made the list of crazy bases number four. So we're going to go through uh, and hit this attack. I didn't speed it up. I guess I could have. But uh, the second one, I think I sped up a little bit more. Uh, while we're at it, let's talk a little bit of uh, tactics. Without walls, tactics are, are much, much easier, of course. So uh, we're just going to stack these rangers up. Pop a little heal, throw an EMP right in the middle. EMP took out a uh, nice steel, took out the tower, and took out the infantry. So I'm getting hit by nothing except a sentry gun. And we're just storming through him. Now about 50% of his defenses are down. So one more EMP when we get a little closer. Good to uh, wrap this up all together. There we go. So EMP takes out the artillery and takes out the Theo at the top. It did have a little surprise down at the bottom, a couple stealth tanks. Uh, no big deal because he didn't really have anything. To, uh, stealth tanks don't do any good unless you've got some defensive structures. So I know he's working on the artillery here, uh, but you know even steel, uh, still I don't think it's a real serious base because the you know lack of use of the walls. But even if it were, a pretty bad placement of the stealth tanks because what what you want the tanks to do is lock people up. So something fires and knocks them down. The stealth tanks usually aren't going to win a war by themselves. So let's take a look at, I guess, Saiyan back. And you guys know if it's an X, I'm going to attack it. I mean, I've put that out there a long time. I don't like X bases, but I like this one even worse. Um, if you guys get a chance, rewind that. I will say that is the world's, and this is on me, the world's worst whiff of an orbital strike. So I'm orbiting a strike here on this metal rain, and the phone rings, and... Uh, I just thought I was lined up perfectly, and I actually managed to put an orbital strike right in the middle of those two fixtures without hitting anything. Probably the worst whiff of an orbital strike you will ever see in the history of Empires and Allies. So, yeah, I was sort of talking through that. I was going to distract you, and I thought, nah, let's uh, let's go ahead and call it out so you guys can see how bad I was there. All right, so here's the deal with this dude. Um, you know, I put all the rangers down at the bottom, and these walls that are supposed to sort of segment and force you to go, they're open and look at look in the middle my healers are just free range they're going back and forth so the walls serve absolutely zero purpose you might as well take in these walls and spell bad boy over in the corner because they have the same amount of effect this, this these walls have zero effect on this battle and I mean I'll just zoom into a couple different areas you can see my rangers and my healers are they're just going at will they're going back and forth so right here uh, look they just go through the walls nothing to fire over nothing to slow them down you know, maybe I have to take a little step to the left or a step to the right, but there is no benefit to these walls whatsoever. So even the time it took to lay this out um, and to extend it, totally wasted. Now, if you would have connected all of them, it would have definitely been a smaller X, but it at least would have had some benefit because the troops would have had to go around. So when you see, you know, the purpose of an X, even I don't like it, is to keep you in kind of one quadrant. But you can see I've got a perfect van all the way across, and I'm just going to speed up and go through this so you guys can see. So let me know which one you think is craziest. The bad boy or the guy who uh, thinks he used his walls properly but ended up just being a bad boy. So alright, thanks uh, once again. My name is Killshot. Leave in the comments what you'd like to see. Give these videos a thumbs up. Tell all your friends to play Empires and Allies and uh, I'll see you guys on the battlefield this weekend. Peace.